That's not, so cute. Thank you. That's a cute shirt. Thank you. Um, all right, so okay. the New York Times, back in 1985, called the first of its kind modern day epilator okay. Okay. a revolutionary <laughs> device. Fast forward, this one from PopSonic does not have a cord. It is rechargeable, yes. it is full power, and it comes in the most adorable prints for summertime, keep yourself hair free, underarms. I'm gonna take my jacket off and do mine. Your underarms? Yeah, yeah. seriously. It's my face. That is my hurt. No. No, it's the best. No, it's it's the best. I mean, do you tweeze and pluck anywhere? Just my face. Okay, well. No, when you, you know do your, your underarm, okay. You okay. literally, when oh you do God. your underarm, what? will you not believe your underarm? No, too, is it grossing you out? I not do it on air because I'm too nervous. Why? <laughs> but I totally love it. That's great. I love it. Love, love it. Sean. Your underarms, oh when they God. are smooth as a baby's butt, it's the best feeling. Um, okay, can you tell everybody the choices? Because we're obviously going to spend some time talking about epilators. Okay, fine. We'll go through choices and then we can. So these are, Sean, do you want to just take a little credit? These are designs that you did. Thank you. So these are Sean, These are Sean's designs. They. This is the white dog. So if you want the turquoise one, it's called the white dog. This one right here is called floral, which actually on the other side looks like this. So it's called pink floral. Mm -hmm. And then this one at the end is called ladybug. So they're all super adorable. So okay. what's great about this epilator and PopSonic did this, this is the first epilator that PopSonic has done and I'm really proud of it because it's a 32 tweezer epilator. So frankly, it's great for all over the body, legs, arms, bikini area, underarm, toes, but chin. Um, know, what's stubborn. great about epilation is that you're removing hair from the root. So it means that that hair is not showing back up on your body tomorrow, the next day, or the day after that. It takes weeks and weeks for that hair to grow back. And, and when it does finally come back, it's, it's, and this is why we're addicted to it, it doesn't come back in thicker, yeah, but it comes back in you finer. you have to wait for it to fully come back? In no. Work? So can I, I mean, I don't want to have razor stubble, so no. how short or how long does the hair have to be? So the beautiful part about epilation is that unlike with waxing, where you have to let that hair come oh, in um, and actually grow to a certain length, this has to be so, so tiny. Like you barely feel this on your skin, the hair, and you're ready to epilate again. So what's wonderful, about you don't have to go through that period of time where you're embarrassed about your hair. You simply, Take the epilator to your skin. It finds all of the hair that you physically can't find yourself even. You can't I, even see it. Let me feel your armpit. For real? <laughs> yeah. Come here. I didn't feel it. Oh, I want to feel so, it. It looks really oh good. Oh, my God. God. <laughs> That's like baby smooth. I know. I'm telling you, you guys, you, I used to wax them because I did really love the feeling of them being completely smooth, soft. But then the waxing, like I will say, oh. aside from driving there, making an appointment, all of that, um, wa when you take wax, molten wax, and rip it off your skin, it takes skin cells with it. Yep. So a lot of people that are sensitive can't even deal in the wax realm. The cool thing about epilation is it's giving you the elongated period of time in terms of grow back because it's getting the hair from the root. Yeah. It's not cutting it off at the surface and then, of course, then you have stubble. I used to shave every single day. Like, that was always what I did, every single day. I think a lot of you still do. You know, this is something that, epilation is one of these, like, age-old techniques age. that we always come back to because, age. you know, a lot of women can't laser, right? Laser's number one expensive, number two, it doesn't work for everybody, and number three is it is it really takes a number of times for it to even get a, you know, to get a result. With waxing, yeah, it's an appointment and you have to grow it out. Epilation, this can be used corded or uncorded, or, or uncorded. It's faster even if you use it corded. Oh, it is? Yeah, and it also even has the cover on it. So if you're like, hey, I'm really nervous about starting with epilation. Oh, good, talk about that. You can put the cover on, which I'll come over I'm being told we're quick. busy. Let me show you um, real quick. These ship totally for free. There's totally the cover. Totally for free. There's the cute prints. Totally for free. That's the sensitivity cover. This is the sensitivity, co sensitivity cover. It will come right onto the top of the epilation and it basically makes this about half as big. So you can make this like a baby epilator. That's the ladybug, which is adorable. Sean, I love how you did the, pop the designs for this because it made it poppy and fun. It's and then, funny because um, I just never, the thing is epilation has been around for so long it that has. people think it's totally an old fashioned way to take care of the problem. And I'll tell you what, it's literally. if you don't like hair, then you want to get rid of it and 
keep it going for as long as possible. Shaving, trimming, plucking, yes, because it's from the root, but you can't pluck one by one the hairs mm -hmm. under your arms oh. or your legs. So, And the other thing right? too is, and Sean, we've talked about this too, is that with epilation, you notice, like, if you over tweezed your eyebrows when you were like 16, you know what I'm talking about. If you over pluck, it, or not over, if you pluck a hair over and over and over again, it stops coming back. That's why women literally, I mean, I will never forget the conversation I had with Dr. Dinesh, and she never minds me saying this because it's true. She literally is like, I don't have hair anymore. She doesn't like have, she's like, I don't. I said, do you want one of my epilators? She's like, I don't need it, darling. Because <laughs> she literally, she literally, she's been epilating for, she was like, I've been epilating for years. I don't have any hair anymore. Well, can I tell you something? Wow. Mediterranean, very popular. Um, you know, obviously uh, Europe, Eastern, Western. Epilation is a gold standard in other parts of the world for it removing works. hair. Um, but I, I just wanted you guys to see this one because we're getting into the but, season where like tank tops yeah. and legs and everything's showing your the skin. the technology advanced though from yes. when it first oh, started. Oh my gosh, okay. Because let's be honest, yes. okay, when they first came out, yep. it was a they torture were screaming, to fight. screaming painful. Yes, yes. So has it evolved? Has it gotten better? Yep. Sean swears by it. Swear. And she has, and I put it on Facebook, the softest armpits I've ever felt in my life. Sean and I always talk about this because oh, it's true. Nanny, it took what a it took you are. <laughs> it took us a long time to get back at epilators because the truly the first epilators that came out, and honestly for about a decade, they were really painful. Brutal. They were slow. Yep. Um, they didn't have as many tweezers, or if they did, like it just did they weren't as tight, they didn't get as much hair. The tweezers now rotate so fast. You feel this prickly sensation. I'm not gonna say that you don't feel it. You do. You feel epilation, but I'll tell you what, every single time you do it, you feel it less, you get used to it. We're shipping these for free. We have never been able to say that before. The colors, prints, exclusive. You're either getting the pink floral, which is white with a flower on the back, or you're getting the ladybug, or you're getting the white dog. So cute. Um, yeah, I mean, I think it's a smoking deal, but more importantly, it's if you've never tried epilation, trust me, I said I never would. I know, and then I made I a did. and I made a liar out of ya. <laughs> you did. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Thanks, my lady. Okay, bye, girls. All right. Bye. This was fun. Um, guess what? What? Laura Geller is here. She's going to bring us something.